Welcome to Optical Communication Playlist. Here in this session, I'll explain comparison of LED and laser and both of these devices are used in transmitting circuit of optical communication. So here we will be comparing both of these devices, LED light emitting diode and laser light activated simulation emission of radiation. So both of these devices that I'll be comparing here based on parameters which I have mentioned here. So when we talk about first parameter efficiency, then based on efficiency, LED is having lower efficiency compared to laser. So LED has low efficiency compared to laser and laser has high efficiency compared to LED. Now response time. Now when we talk about response time, it is a time taken by device to get respond in terms of light. And here response time of laser is fast compared to LED and response time of LED that is low means slow. So it is actually slow means it will take little more response time uh, to respond it to respond it in terms of time. Now third parameter that is data rate. Now see when you use LED at that time because of some limitations of spectral width data rate of this sources will be less with LED. So data rate is low with LED and data rate is high with laser. Now when we talk about spectrum then spectrum will be broad in LED. So its spectral width that will be broad in case of LED. So here spectral width is broad with LED and spectral width will be sharp or narrow with LED. So very few wavelengths that will be there in its spectral width with laser and spectral width of LED will be very broad. Now next parameter is beam nature. Now when we talk about beam nature here I just want to convey what is the coherence of beam which we are transmitting by using these two devices. So light beam is not coherent in case of LED while light beam will be coherent in case of laser. So here you will be having coherent light beam and here with LED we have non-coherent light beam. Now when we talk about power, how much power is getting transmitted by these two devices. So obviously laser is transmitting higher power in terms of light compared to LED. So high power is getting transmitted by laser and low power is getting transmitted by LED. Now here, what is the distortion that is received at output side by using LED and laser? So distortion obviously will be high in case of LED and distortion will be low in case of laser when we send signal as a light in optical cable. So distortion will be high in case of LED and distortion will be less by using laser. Now next parameter is dispersion. So how much pulse broadening is happening? So obviously by having LED pulse broadening will be high and pulse broadening will be less as if we use laser. Now in terms of distance, now in terms of distance how much distance signal can travel as if we send signal by using LED. So laser is being used for long distance transmission of signal while for short distance transmission for short distance transmission 
we use LED. Now, as we send high power by using laser, you'll be finding heating problem that is more in case of laser. So heating problem that is more in case of laser and heating problem that is very less in case of LED. And when we talk about temperature sensitive sensitivity, then temperature sensitivity that is less as there is no heating problem. So temp temperature sensitivity that is less in case of LED and temperature sensitivity that is more in case of laser. As we send high power as a light through optical cable by using laser. Now when we talk about structure, so structure is very simple in case of LED and structure is complicated in case of laser and that I have made session where you can see its structure and how it is getting responded in terms of light and all those things that I have covered in separate session so you just go through it in this playlist of optical communication where I have explained everything here I am just comparing both now see transmitting circuit so transmitting circuit is simple by using LED and transmitting circuit that is complicated when you use laser and when we talk about lifetime of device then lifetime of device with LED is more and lifetime of device with laser is less and why lifetime of device with laser is less the reason is it transmits high power so it is temperature sensitive there is a problem of heating so all those things will reduce lifetime of laser while when you use LED we transmit low power and because of we transmit low power there is less heating problem and temperature sensitivity is even less and because of that lifetime of LED that will be more. So let us have a quick review again. See when we talk about LED, so efficiency of LED is less compared to efficiency of laser. Response time of laser is fast so it takes less response time and response time of LED is slow so it takes more time to give response. Data rate of circuitries by using laser is high compared to data rate with circuitry using LED and spectrum of LED is broad and laser is having narrow spectrum. When we talk about beam nature, non-coherent light beam that is there with LED and coherent light beam that is there with laser and power transmission is low with LED and power transmission is high with laser. Distortion is even high with LED and distortion is very less by using laser and when we talk about dispersion means pulse broadening so that is even high in, in case of LED and dispersion is less by using laser. LED has been used for short distance transmission of signal and laser has been used for long distance transmission of signal and as we send high power by using laser there is heating problem while that heating problem is low in case of LED as we send low power so heating problem is less in case of LED and temperature sensitivity is even less with LED as there is less heating problem while in case of laser there is more heating problem so it is more temperature sensitive and when we see structure of LED so that is very simple and there is complicated structure which is there with laser. Transmitting circuit that is even very simple in case of LED and transmit, transmitter, transmitter circuit that will be complicated by using laser as we need to have Simulate, stimulated emission of radiation by using laser and obviously lifetime is more of LED 
the reason is we send less power and it operates at low power while lifetime of laser is less as we send high power for long distance transmission so there is heating problem and which is resulting into low lifetime of device so this is what the basic comparison which is there with led and laser i hope that you have understood this session thank you so much for watching this video you just give your valuable suggestions definitely based on it in future i'll make videos which will ensure to cover all those things which is required here on my channel thank you so much